Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the Lavoit air purifier. In particular, the model we have is the LV-H128. I did purchase this product myself and any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this product or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. Here's a look at the retail box and packaging. Everything looks great. They walk you through some key tech specs and features all around the box. This has aromatherapy. You can add your favorite essential oils, supports up to 161 square feet of clean air. Obviously this traps pollutants and allergens and helps reduce odors and fumes. Sleep easy with their sleep mode. They advertise 28 decibels and their high fan speed setting is only 44 decibels. They also have a true HEPA filter with three stage filtration. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and look at the contents. Looking for a secure and reliable way to access the internet? Look no further than ExpressVPN. Protect your personal information and browsing history from prying eyes. Act now and sign up for ExpressVPN today using our link in the description and receive an extra three months of service for free. Here are all the contents. First up, we have our product literature consisting of their customer service and contact card. This does come with the one year warranty and you can register to get an additional year for free. Next, we have the full user guide and manual walking us through some quick tech specs. This ideal room size is gonna be 161 square feet and the noise level is gonna range anywhere between 28 and 44 decibels. Very detailed charts and diagrams walking you through everything you need to know about this particular air purifier. And they do have an option for you to add essential oils to the aroma box cap. Care, maintenance instructions, you get the idea. Troubleshooting section, warranty info, customer service. Next, we have our power supply and adapter. And lastly, we have the air purifier. Let's look at this in more detail. Here's the unit up close. From the top, you'll see we have a warning label here to only add essential oils to the aroma pad and to remove filters from their packaging before use and make sure the pull tabs are facing inward. Here's a look at the top and we can pop this cap open to reveal the aroma pad for your essential oils to diffuse in your room. Moving right along, we'll look at the very front. We got the Lavoit logo and branding, our control button with indicator ring, and we have our sleep light, low light, and high light right there. Let's look at it from the side. I really like this off-white color scheme with the gray accent, silvery accent up at the top. Additional product information on the back side with our DC barrel connector. Here's a look at the other side. We do have our air intake right there. So you'll notice that on both sides, but not the front or the back side. And let's flip it over to the very bottom. We have our four grip feet and we have our open and close indicator here. So let's turn it to open it up. And that's gonna reveal our two filters that we need to pull out and remove the packaging. The packaging has been removed. Take a look at the filter from all different sides and angles with our friendly reminder that the pull tabs should face inward. So when we're installing them back in the unit, they'll be just like you see right here. And now we're ready to go ahead, line up the cap and then just twist it the opposite direction to close. And it's time to start using our air purifier. So we have the unit plugged in, let's go ahead, power it on. We have one touch control button here that illuminates white when it's powered on. We're currently in the sleep setting. We'll tap again, now we're in low. We'll tap again, now we're in high and we touch it one more time and it turns off. This ring will also illuminate red when it's time to check your filters. So very simple and straightforward controls. Now let's get to some testing. So the first thing we're looking at is the air quality indicator. So for the room right here, we're showing that we have nice clean air fluctuating between four and eight, the lower, the better here. I can toggle between some of the other values. So you'll see our air is nice and clean. HCHO is 0 0.01, PM 2.5 is one, TVOC is 0 0.04, and we're back to our AQI score. On this unit, please note that there is no air quality indicator. I do feel like that's a big miss, especially with that illuminated ring. It'd be nice if it could be color coded. So maybe you have a separate little LED for the filter and then red could be you have dirty air, orange, you know, semi-clean, green, clean. You get the idea. So it'd be nice to have that that is missing on this unit. But with its size, we already have clean air here. It should be able to, in this room, continue to keep our air nice and clean and fresh. This is gonna be optimal to use maybe in a small office, your bedroom, places like that around your house. Now this air purifier is whisper quiet. So currently I have it in the sleep setting here. The max decibel readout that we got was 36.8 decibels in this setting. In the low setting, we got a max decibel readout of 44.3 decibels. And in our high 
setting, we got a max readout of 54.5 decibels. So regardless of the setting that you use, it's gonna be very quiet. You will notice and hear it with that high setting, but sleep, and low are very quiet. You'll be hard pressed to hear it if it's more than just a couple feet away from you in your room. So if you wanted an air purifier, maybe to be on your nightstand or bedside, but you didn't want really loud, annoying fan noise, this could definitely be one to consider. While this unit's small in stature with the highest fan speed setting turned on, we peaked at 787.4 feet per minute. So it's very capable of moving a lot of air around the room that it's located in. And it's great to see those fan speeds with something that's so quiet and small. Now it's time to have some fun with my favorite test. This is the smoke test. We're gonna shoot smoke into the air intake to see how much of the smoke gets trapped in the filter and how much is gonna make its way out through the top. So let's just go ahead and fire it up. So quite a bit of smoke is making its way through the top for a filter at this size and price point. I'd say that's about what you can expect. Some filters, believe it or not, will be able, especially on larger units, to actually trap all the smoke. But let's go out a little bit, and now you'll be able to see maybe some of the airflow too. We'll shoot some smoke around here so you get a feel for the pull of it bringing in the air from your room all on its own, and then the nice clean air coming out the top. So pretty cool, the smoke's accumulating here, but anything down below, it's coming right up, in and out. So let me share with you my final thoughts after using this Lavoie air purifier. It's small, it's compact, it's gonna be made for smaller rooms, bedrooms, to easily take with you maybe to the office, things like that, that's where this unit's going to excel. I'd like to see some better filtration in the future as well as an air quality indicator light to monitor in real time the status of the air. So you can visually see, oh, it's green, that means it's good. Oh, it's red, that means it's dirty, it's working on cleaning, that sort of thing. I will give them credit, they have a great feature up top where we can use this as a two-in-one device. Now it's an essential oils diffuser. So I love seeing that creativity with the design right there. I just wish that they included that air quality indicator with this particular unit.